Hi, I'm Kim Tran with Coldwell Banker of Westboro Realty. I just want to give you a brief synopsis of our market in 2012. In the beginning of the year, it was a very stable market with seeing some price increases. But near the end of the year, uh, it became a buyer's market and depending on which area you were in, um, the value of homes and condos either lost between a mere 5% to about 10% at the height of the value. Now, during the year 2012, all we heard from the economists were three things. One, the pending collapse of the European Union, which did not happen. The current fiscal cliff that the United States is facing right now, and if they do not pass that, uh, we're going to have another dire prediction. It's starting to sound like the 2012 Mayan prediction of December 21st. So I'm going to sell everything before that happens. Just kidding. But I really feel that the politicians in North America, in the United States, will find a way to figure out this fiscal cliff and move on and rise above all this politician and political strife. Now for us, the economists keep predicting the bubble, the bubble in Vancouver will burst. Yes, they will be right eventually, but I heard this many times. And with the bubble, it's usually when a significant shock happens in the economy that causes the bubble to happen. And I don't see that happening in the near future. So once again, why Vancouver market and why you should be in real estate. We are voted number five, once again, top place to live in the world. No other North American city have made it on this top 10 list. And on top of that, Gastown is voted the number four most trendiest place to live in the entire world. I'm gonna step out of the way and show you why this is and why I chose to live in the Woodwards. Wishing everybody a happy holiday, happy Hanukkah, Merry Christmas, all the best in 2013. See you next year.